Hey, Retired at 40. It's been a real long time since I've done a vlog. We've been really busy. Uh, we're kind of in the manic phase of our uh, ramping up for retirement. We have about a year and a half, maybe a little less, uh, before we're ready to actually retire. And there's a lot involved with that. And at the same time, we're kind of learning things. We have to make a budget. And, uh, you know, things will change a lot. Our income will uh, change quite a bit, but we're in our manic phase right now, so it's pretty much save, 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 and uh, getting all of our finances straightened out because retiring at 40 is a pretty scary proposition. Uh, you have a lot of life left, ideally, uh, after you retire, and we're both leaving behind uh, businesses that we've taken 15 years to build and kind of leave, leaving at the peak of our business, which is also uh, pretty tough to do. So we've also been trying to kind of whittle down our material items, just because as we're going through this whole process, we're kind of realizing that we don't need a lot of the stuff that we have, and we're kind of just trying to uh, live up to the retired at 40 slogan, live life simple, because it kind of brings things that are more important in life uh, into perspective when you eliminate a lot of the material items. I don't really feel like we're selling ourselves short by doing this. Um, we're more just kind of trimming the fat of what we've accumulated uh, in our adult lives, which is a lot of times just a, you take a step back and you realize that it's really just not necessary in life. And if, if anything, it just complicates it. So I'm also happy to say we're completely out of debt. Um, we, we owe nothing to anyone, with the exception of our taxes, property taxes, income taxes, that, that everyone has to pay. We've also been trying to capitalize on the Denver real estate market, which has had a big boom in the last three to four years, and everything has just gotten to really high prices. So we've done a couple of uh, extra fix and flip properties, and we're taking that income, we're putting it into Iowa, which is where we're moving to. Uh, we're buying up real estate there um, because that's always kind of been our bread and butter is uh, rentals and real estate investments. So we're getting ready to go back to Iowa to visit family for the holidays and we're going to take that opportunity to check up on the house that we bought to move into when we do retire and uh, also check up on our, our other rental properties while we're there. So to kind of sum everything up, everything's on schedule, if not um, maybe just a little bit ahead of schedule, which is great. Um, it's a good feeling because everything is kind of starting to become reality now. But it's also a little bit unnerving because you kind of realize that it is happening and it's going to happen. And uh, it's scary being young and retiring. And I also want to say thanks to all the people that have watched the videos and supported me and made comments and subscribed and this kind of just, uh, I did this as a just kind of something to do as fun and uh, it's actually, it's gotten kind of addictive for me and I really enjoy it. So I appreciate all your support and comments through my journey and stay tuned because there's more to come. This is soon to be Retired at 40. Remember to live life simple. We'll catch you next time.